Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm trying to get this walk in real quick before I continue with my day. So what I actually have to do today is actually just wait for the rain also. <laughs> Taking breaks. Or you name it. It is a beautiful day still. One of those mornings. Today I got the opportunity to even be by myself even more. And something that actually came into my mind during this walk today is I just do not know. It is funny how when you're growing up, you were taught that this is what you're supposed to do, what you're not supposed to do. Uh, this is what career you're supposed to have. But as time progresses, you begin to realize that it's all an illusion. Because one is never taught how to be authentic. One is never thought reality. Most of us, from the moment we were born, we were actually taught how to lie to ourselves. So we begin to lie to ourselves. And the more untruthful we become to, to ourselves, the more self-love disappears from within. We were not taught to be able to sit down and take a look at things from a critical ideology. But we were given an ideology that confuses us. An ideology that makes us think we have to settle for less. An ideology that makes us think that we don't deserve to be in a better place. But the moment you begin to realize those ideologies, that they're not working for you because they cause emotional pain, spiritual pain, you get rid of it. And getting rid of it doesn't mean it hasn't taught you anything. It's just that it isn't working anymore. So these days, I was actually supposed to run 28 miles today, but I just don't feel like rain, running in the, in the rain. So I decided I'm just going to walk it instead, and that way I can cover up. <laughs> and uh, still continue walking and just kind of just walk everywhere, is what I've been doing. I have had an immense thought, beautiful ideology, and compassion become one of the main things that I focus on. So each step I take is all about compassion. Every emotion that I deal with is coming from a sense of love. And it's really funny that when you begin to tap into your higher self, you realize that for some reason you cry a lot. And that crying doesn't mean because you're sad. It just means you're elevating yourself into a spiritual consciousness that many feel, many just refuse to tap into it. Because we were born with this intelligence that we don't even know how to use. I dream a lot. I see things beyond my own imagination. It is unbelievable. So when each time when I'm out here, I'm not just out here for the fun of it anymore. I'm out here because I'm seeking, asking questions. Best days of my life, I cannot deny that. Because I begin to see things differently from how I used to see it before. So that being said today, that's the emotion that I'm going through at this moment as I do this quick walk. 
and I'm going to say happy. Is it Tuesday today? I can't wait to run. I can't wait to do my account number 195 or 94 tomorrow. Happy Tuesday and one love.